Hi, welcome, Simon here, and I hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll take a look at the power button. For some reason that this power button is not feeling the click and the computer is not powering on. This is a Lenovo IdeoPad 3. That's pretty much it. I can show it to you because the serial number is all worn out in the back. It's not able to identify the actual model. All right, let's jump right into it. I'll be using a Phillips screwdriver. Let's remove all the screws here so that we can get into the computer. It looks like all the screws are in the same size. So if you mix match the screw, I apologize. Let me say that one more time. The bottom screws are much shorter. It looks like the bottom four is a lot smaller and then the rest of it are much longer. So do not mix match the screw. Um, just gonna give you a heads up on that part. All right, once all the screws are removed, the next step is to go ahead and pry it open. Alright, it does look like the USB, the I.O. board is actually pushed in. You can see that the, um, the board here on this side is broken. And that is the power button to power up the computer. No wonder the computer doesn't power up because this thing, this thing is broken. Hmm. Yeah, I try to press it and it still doesn't work. It looks like the uh this whole piece needs to be replaced. Yep, so we have to replace this, uh, this power button board here. Hey, maybe not. Am I? Do I need to? Yeah, I think so. So this one is more likely the touch ID sensor. There's the uh, the IC chip here connected to the motherboard. But I think this is still the main board that powers up the computer. And we need to find a replacement for that. And unfortunately, um, I do not have the replacement right now. I need to order it. So I'm not able to finish up the repair, but I will need to find a replacement part for this. All right. Sorry about the uh, not a full repair tutorial, but this is all I have. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye now.